Hello, all my fellow Knights, Vikings, Samurai, Ammo, and my name is Nebula, and uh, double upload today, and second video for today is discussing uh, the thing that you're seeing on the screen right now, the um, Paw Patrol spin-off that we will be getting in the same year as the Mighty movie. Very interesting, to say the least. Um, I, uh, I'll say this much, alright, uh, I... <coughs> Sorry, I really wasn't expecting a... Um, a spin-off in any way. More or less, when I'd mentioned spin-off, I was more or less just speaking out of this is a hopeful, fan-made kind of thing, and when I hear people talking about it, they don't really, it doesn't, they don't honestly think that we'd actually be getting a spin-off. Usually, when it comes down to it, I was expecting there not to be one, mainly just because of the whole, like, kids, kids show thing, and there isn't really too much they can expand, because it's like, if they were going to let us know about, um, another pup's like story or something like that then they could probably save it within the movie there's no reason for it to be in the series but looks like we're getting one and from the information we're seeing here okay it's it's look it, the idea is is that one of the fan favorite pups quote those words by the way one of the fan favorite pups will be getting like a spin-off series and sort of like dedication of them okay now i uh i have a couple of ideas um Mm, but I'll start with this, okay? I think the spin-off series is going to be based around, or for, Marshall. Now, the reason I'm saying that is because it would be unlikely that they would do Chase because he's already been given this, like, development through the property of the movie, and... Yes, well, he is, t that might not be confirming, he is one of the fan favourites. I feel like they'll maybe try not to do something for just someone that they've already done. So, I mean, who knows. And, technically, the fan favourites are probably Chase, Marshall and Sky. Those, that trio sort of resonates well. Like, don't get me wrong, like, I'm a fan of Zuma, and there's plenty of fans for Zuma, Robert and Rocky as well. But I feel like the true fan favourites of those, like, uh, like are, are the main, f like, are the three that I mentioned. So, Chase, Marshall and Sky. And I have a feeling that since Sky is going to have her big development during Paw Patrol the Mighty movie in the same year, it'd be unlikely that they'd choose her for the spin-off series as well, because that's kind of like, you know, we don't, it's alright seeing her get development, but we'll see her get development in this, and we'll just, we'll, uh, we'll wait a little bit. Um, so yeah, that's why I do think it's going to be Marshall. Because I really honestly think that when he says the fan favourites, like, Marshall's one of the poster buddies, if you will, for Paw Patrol. I mean, more often than not, when you ask someone in the fandom who their favourite pup is, it will be Marshall. It's not mine's, of course, um, but that's not to say I don't like Marshall. I do think he's very good. He's uh, probably my third favourite. Chase is my second. But anyways, um, the idea that I've had, um, obviously, since I do think it's going to be Marshall... I've had this idea in my head for a while, and I feel like it could work. So here's my idea. Paw Patrol Academy, right? So what the idea of it is, is that Marshall is now grown up, and he is teaching these young generations of pups how to do his job, and, how, and basically just how to be a great rescuer. Now... Now, there's a couple reasons why I feel like this could work. Number one, if it's dedicated to Marshall, it could show that he can still be clumsy even in relatively um, older years. And plus, him being a teacher, that's like a that's a good lesson as well. When I slip, Because when you think about it, right, if they're going to have a good message behind this because of the younger audience, then putting a teacher into it would be quite good. Showing just no matter how weird or crazy they are, they can still get teach people great things and they can teach them to be amazing and... You know, stuff, stuff, stuff like that, and I feel like Marshall is definitely up there as the pick for it, so that's why. And this Paw Patrol Academy thing, I would like to clarify something here. Do I think Marshall is a parent in this spin-off? No, I do not. I want to clarify this here. Do I think any of the pups will, are, are parents in this spin-off? No, absolutely not. This spin-off idea is based around Marshall as an adult, not a parent. Can I clarify this, okay? So yeah, now that I've done that, this uh, spin-off, I'm really looking forward to it. Go watch the Epic Meets video if you want to get an idea of what he thinks for the sub-series as well. Um, I'm looking forward to it, and I'll see you all next time. So, bye-bye.